Welcome back everyone and the Lego Walmart clearance season for 2022 has officially kicked off so I wanted to kind of announce it to you guys and show off my my kind of initial haul. This was from a few stores on kind of day one. I've only been out one trip so far. I plan on going to more places of course over the next week or so but I picked up a decent little haul right now. Uh, you know good prices nothing too crazy and nothing to really write home about but I will show you guys right off the bat. So I picked up nine of the Lego Friends 41687 Magical Fun Fair stalls. Uh, these are normally 40 down to $15 each, so I picked up nine of them. Very good deal. Uh, all this ranges from about 40 to like 65% off or so. So that will be a, a solid part out. I'm actually going to part these out later tonight. Uh, that will be a, a lot of nice pieces in there. I picked up uh, three of these 11016s right here, 1,200 piece classic boxes, uh, still sealed and... I forgot what I paid for these. I want to say $15 each as well, but it might have been $20. But uh, kind of going to, be, going to be a hassle to part these out. But I picked them up for now. Might end up returning those. Not too sure. Uh, this right here uh, really sucks. There's only one of them. Uh, 41702 Canal Houseboat. I uh, believe this is normally 80 but this was down to only 50 So uh, this is one of those where it was, again, I think 40% off that comes out too. And uh, only one of them. I picked it up for now. Could always return it. But uh, I'm going to hope over the next, say, you know, two or three trips I do out of these Walmarts, I can find at least another two or three of these. Uh, because if I only have one of these, I'm just going to return it. There's no point. I don't part out one of a set. Even two of a set is just not really worth my time. But I picked that up for now. Uh, this one was a very good deal right here. Not a lot of pieces, but it's an overall good deal. I picked up two of these 60329s uh, school days right here. Uh, normally 70 down to 25. So that is, you know, roughly 60% off or so. But again, only 433 pieces in there. So the part out's still decent. I'm going to part out all the minifigures, but again, hopefully I can find at least another one of these. Over here, guys, I always like these small little sets, nice little part outs, and usually you can find a lot of them. I picked up, what was that, five of the uh, 43198 Anna's Castle Courtyard, uh, $10 down to four. Uh, the figure goes for about four bucks herself. So overall, like I said, very easy part out, and I love getting those small sets. Over here, I picked up uh, two more of the Batmobile, the Penguin Chases, uh, 30 down to 15. Uh, I, if you guys remember... I did find, I think, like seven or nine of these, uh, like three or four months ago for, uh, I found a couple for $3 and a couple for $7. A part of those out figures went really well. I think I've only got one penguin left, maybe like two Batman left. Uh, so overall, I found two of these. Again, hopefully I can find more. Uh, if not, I might just keep these sealed long term. I'm not too sure. Moving on, guys. We have one of these Harry Potter uh, moments uh, uh, sets right here. 30 down to 15. 76283. That's half off, of course, but again, only one of them, so that kind of sucks. Up here, I'm definitely going to probably end up returning these. Uh, I just kind of bought these on a whim, but you know, these are normally supposed to be like $20 sets. Like, it's already kind of overpriced for 20 bucks, I think. And now the markup is now $25. So, $25 down to $15, not even half off as is, let alone I still count these, especially as like $20 sets. So, picked up two of them, definitely going to return these. Uh, the part out is barely a 2x and uh, not a lot of good stuff in there. So, that's definitely being returned. Uh, these are pretty cool up here. I'm a big fan of these. Wish I found more. Uh, 71398 Dory's Beach front 30 down to 10 picked up two of them nice little mario set uh this i'm a big fan of as well this is a solid part out i'm gonna end up keeping one of these tigers for myself i found three of these right here uh 43208 it is the jasmine and mulan's adventure uh only 176 pieces so not too crazy but these were what 30 or 40 i down to 13 all i know is i paid 13 dollars each on these so very good deal the tiger and the uh the horse herself goes for i think about 13 bucks already uh, over here, guys, this is probably one of the highlights. Again, I wish there was more of these. Uh, 71391 Bowser's Airship, uh, normally 100 down to 40. So 60% off, and the part out is beautiful on them. Uh, luckily, I found three, but I would not mind picking up another three. So hopefully, I can find those. Over here, guys, I picked up two of the Pivot Drives. This is a very old set. This is 2018 still. Uh, no, it's 2020. Wow, that came out in 2020. Damn, 75968, uh, 800 pieces, two of these. Uh, 70... Or I think maybe $80 now, but I paid $35 each. So either half off or a little over half off on the two of those. It sucks. And the more I look at it, I've got a lot of twosies here. But uh, that really does suck. Because they usually my, my limit is I part out uh, three of a set. Right here, guys, we have 21183, the training grounds. Uh, normally, let's see what this was, 70 down to 35. This is a brand new set. And actually, these two exclusive figures in here, there's only like five sellers on Bricklink of them. So that's a pretty cool thing. But you got only one of them, so... I'm uh, definitely not going to be part of that anytime soon. Hopefully I can find more of them. This is a pretty solid part. A lot of lots in here, but a very solid deal. I mean, a thousand pieces per box too. Got, got four of these right here. 11015 around the world. And uh, 
Like, so I think I paid, actually, I totally forgot what I paid on these, unless there's a price tag on these. I totally forgot, but all I know is it's a solid deal, like 120 new lots for the Bricklink store. So uh, overall, guys, that is the first initial little haul right here. So as we can tell, some good stuff. There's a few things I'll probably end up returning, uh, just for the fact of the matter, I won't find any more. And, uh, you know, as much as I would love to sit on this set, you know, for years and just invest in it and just, well, quote unquote, invest in it. Uh, and the same with like some of this other stuff. I don't, I just don't really think it's worth it. Again, possibly maybe these two Batmobiles, maybe I'll hold on to this long term. Uh, but some of the stuff, like, I don't know, I don't see this doing anything crazy over the years. So, uh, yeah, that's the haul for now, guys. Like I said, I'm going to part out these. I'm comfortable parting out these right now. And I'm going to go to a few more Walmart trips over the next couple days. And uh, hopefully I can find more to add to this pile, if not just more overall. And I'll do other haul videos then but i wanted to make this video now uh, just like last year kind of announce clear seasons here let you guys know run out to your walmart and you guys uh, will probably find at least 40 percent off uh, if not a little bit more so people are having some pretty good luck out here and uh, i got decently lucky myself you know this was based off of like eight stores though so you gotta think about it like the uh, the ratio is not too good uh, quite a lot of driving quite a lot of time for not too much reward but it's still cool to get something at least but yeah thanks you guys, uh, thanks everyone for watching uh, please leave a comment and subscribe. Uh, stay tuned for you guys later. Bye, guys, and stay safe.